I'd like to first begin with an encouragement to you today. Marriage is wonderful. I'm saying that because we don't hear that enough. Well, we're here today because Jerry and Jasmine believe that marriage is the visible sign of their love. <laughs> well, Jerry and Jasmine, today I'm so glad that you're willing to pursue this thing called marriage. Jerry and Jasmine, you are making a public declaration of your love, and we are here to witness the sealing of this legal agreement. Now, a piece of paper is not going to keep you in a marriage. Here's my charge, Jerry and Jasmine. Marriage is about keeping the promise you have made. Wedding vows are not just a declaration of your present love, but it's also a binding promise of the future love. In order to stay married, you must love one another. When we first met, you were not a Christian. But I was glad that you had a curious and open mind towards faith. Soon after we started dating, our first major conflict due to faith arose. God opposes the proud but gives grace to the humble. I'm thankful that we can both be humbled through our fights, because through those trials we realize our common brokenness. I'm also grateful that we can be healed through the love of Christ, because He has forgiven us so that we can forgive one another. Dear Jerry, I'm beyond joy to become your wife. I love you not only for the witty, curious, and handsome boy you've always been, but also for the increasingly wise, caring, and faithful man you're becoming in Christ. Let us love and cherish with patience and faithfulness till the end of our life. Amen. Amen. <laughs> God has prepared us for each other with intention and careful planning. He waited until we were both mature enough to introduce us and let us struggle hard in order for us to grow fast. In this journey, in this walk with Christ, my biggest realization is understanding how broken we are and how much we needed Him. And my biggest learning, though, is understanding how to truly forgive and the importance to, be, to commit to be loving when it is hard to love. Jess, I just can't wait to embark on this new journey with you. <laughs> now, having declared your love and commitment before God, and these witnesses, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Jerry, now you may kiss the bride. <laughs> yeah. It is now my great delight to present to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Schools. 